Welcome to the April 2020 report for Dash Analytics by Into the Block in partnership with Dash. This is a monthly video report created by Into the Block in partnership with Dash, where we explore the behavior of Dash during the past month using ITB's unique signals and indicators. But first, let me tell you a little bit about Into the Block. Into the Block is a market intelligence platform and a collection of data visualization tools that help investors better understand the behavior of crypto assets. Our 60 plus indicators provide a unique view of every crypto asset's behavior and is a constantly growing ecosystem of intelligence. Now, let's dive into Dash Analytics for April 2020 using Into the Block. What are the main use cases for Dash transactions? We use the transactions distribution chart on Into the Block to show that during the last 30 days, more than 70% of the transactions in the Dash blockchain were used for payments and trading. This is shown here by the light blue region. The 77% indicator means that those transactions were used for merchant purchases and for investment reasons or trading. As the price of Dash increased during April, so did the percentage of payment and trading transactions. In fact, we see that for the past seven days, that figure increased almost 30%. What was the average size of the Dash transactions? Using into the blog average transaction size chart, we can see that for the last seven days, the average size of a Dash transaction was 1,859 US dollars or 22.34 Dash. The 30 day high happened on April 29th with $5,365. This happened when the price of Dash reached $84. As the price of Dash increased consistently in April, so did the average size of the transactions. We can see this by the blue line. This was not only happening in US dollars, but also in terms of Dash. Now, where is Dash mostly traded? We use Into the Block's East versus West indicator that enables us to determine that for the past 14 days, a majority of Dash transactions occurred during Western trading times. This can be seen in the chart by the green columns being greater than the blue columns for every day in the past two weeks. Almost 60% of the transactions happened between 10 a.m. and 10 p.m. UTC. This is usually when people in the Western Hemisphere are awake and either trading or engaging in transactions. Let me give you one last insight. Are Dash token owners hodling? We use into the blocks hodlers indicator that tells us the number of addresses that have been holding an asset for more than one year. In the case of Dash, we see that as of April 30, 626,000 addresses have been holding 5.73 million Dash for over a year. This figure is 26.6 higher than in January of 2020, when 494,000 addresses were, had been holding Dash for more than a year. 45% of total addresses are holders which means that a large proportion of holders may be betting on the long-term vision of Dash and wish to keep the token as an investment. We hope that you have enjoyed this video. For more insights and daily metrics on Dash and other crypto assets, you can sign up to Into the Block for a 7-day free trial. Go now to app.intotheblock.com.